Pat Mayo here with Sunday's Blazing Game Day Picks presented by Buffalo Wild Wings. Good news! With only four teams on by, we're up to 11 games on the main slate this week. And who hates extra options? So, at running back, firing up Melvin Gordon makes the most sense. Returning from bye and a hamstring injury, MG3 played a season-high 88% of the Chargers' offensive snaps. Cracking 100 yards on the ground well, picking up his 10th score of the season. Pretty good! Whether it be by land or by air, Gordon's found pay dirt in six straight games, and now he gets the Raiders. He was limited to 58 rushing yards against Oakland earlier this year, but the best part about Gordon is how he always stays involved, even if he can't get anything going on on the ground. In that contest, he ended up with 62 yards receiving. The game script is massive favorite this week, should net him close to 20 plus touches. And at full health, that'll be enough to propel Gordon near the top of the week 10 running backs. At receiver, it's difficult to judge how the absence of A.J. Green is going to affect Tyler Boyd. Will he be in more difficult coverage, being treated as the most lethal part of the Bengals passing game? I'm guessing it does. Fortunately, that likely won't matter against the Saints, because the volume will overcome the extra attention. In what appears to be a very pass-happy game script for Cincy, expect Boyd to finish with double-digit targets. And against this New Orleans secondary, that should translate into bulk coup. DraftKings points. Finally, at quarterback, there will be the urge to get sneaky and roll out Marcus Mariota against the Patriots. And I don't hate that, actually, but it's probably unnecessary when Andrew Luck's priced down because of his matchup. Yes, Jacksonville's remain stout against the pass, but treating them like their last year's Jags? Big mistake. And like Gordon Boyd, regardless of the matchup, their volume speaks the loudest. The Colts play the fastest pace of any team in football, and in every game where the Colts haven't won by 15 or more, Luck's averaging almost 50 passing attempts per game. He'll get there through attrition. Those were your blazing game day picks presented by Buffalo Wild Wings. I'm Pat Mayo.